Inspired by the crazy cooking experiments of Heston Blumenthal, our very own Dane Levenrad wanted to do something a little bit more creative with a coffee and chocolate pairing. And his moment of genius has now earned his little caffeine creation the title of the world's most Instagrammable coffee. Returning from a career abroad as a coffee consultant, Dane opened The Grind to a sizzling reception thanks to its flagship Coffee in a Cone. Dane, your coffee in a cone has taken the world by storm on the gram, but where did it all begin? When we knew we were going to open in Moira's Arch, I needed a game changer for the, for the sector. It's really competitive in Joburg. There's a lot of coffee shops around, so we needed something to bring the masses into our shop and then hopefully keep them when they tasted how good our coffee was. What was the taste test like and how many cones did you have to get through to get the perfect one? Sure, a number, I'd, I'd probably say a couple of hundred. A good ratio of, of different compounds of chocolates, bringing stuff, stuff in from different countries also. There were multiple times where we didn't think we were going to get it right because it, it just broke down so quickly from the heat. But now, now it's perfect. The cone is lined with four layers of chocolate compounds and filled with espresso, macchiato or hot chocolate, leaving drinkers with a few leak-proof minutes to add their snaps to more than one million tags. The coffee is amazing, but the cones themselves are absolutely delectable. How often do you have to prepare them to keep up with the demand? So at the moment we are struggling with production just because of the demand, so we are manufacturing every day and we get them fresh every morning. We've kind of held it back a little bit just to keep the, the volumes of people at bay, especially now that we're trending internationally. A lot of people have come in to experience the cone, but yeah, we're selling out almost every day. For a concept this cool, you have to make sure you do that Instagram pic some justice. So a few tips for me are, make sure you have absolutely gorgeous lighting, hold the cone at an angle so you get all those beautiful curves and the heart in the middle, and most importantly, take a selfie. Don't worry, it won't melt. Just five months old, the store serves 2,000 visitors per week. Its worldwide trending tag proves the secret to successful coffee is not only in the beans. Food trends usually begin somewhere across the shore like America or London, but how amazing is it that the latest trend in coffee is 100% homegrown and hashtag so Instagrammable.